Meanwhile, we are continuing our coverage tonight on the 10 most dangerous intersections in our region. So far, we've taken a look at Southside, Roanoke County, and Lynchburg. Tonight, WSLS 10's Rachel Lucas investigates why more than 200 crashes happen each year at two intersections in Roanoke City. She joins us now live in front of what police say is the most dangerous in the city. Rachel? Well, police tell me that rush hour is the peak time of day for traffic accidents to happen here at the intersection of Orange Avenue and Williamson Road. And as you can see, it's very busy now. Last year, more than 150 traffic accidents happened right here. And police tell me many of them could have been avoided. If you live or work in Roanoke, it's almost a guarantee you drive through this intersection every day. The same road your children's school bus takes this is also traveled by 18 wheelers in rush hour traffic. This intersection is probably by far the busiest in Roanoke, especially in the mornings and later in the evenings. Topping the list in Roanoke, more than 150 traffic accidents happened here just last year. Tons of accidents, tons of accidents. President of Magic City Ford, Cameron Johnson, sees the traffic chaos out his front window every day. At the heart of the city, it's nearly impossible to get through or around Roanoke without traveling this intersection. It's an artery. It's a main, a main road to get to anywhere in the city. Traffic safety officer Fatima Foster says the majority of accidents are only property damage. But in the past two years, two pedestrians have been killed near this area. The number of pedestrians who are at this crosswalk, especially those who don't obey traffic sign, is another contributing factor to making this the most dangerous intersection in Roanoke City. But Foster says the number one reason behind the accidents is, you guessed it, that they're too busy talking on their phone or texting. And the most dangerous distracted driving trend? Nowadays, selfies are very popular while you're driving. It's much of the same problem for the second most dangerous intersection. David Moore, who works at a bird's eye view of Melrose and Peters Creek, says there's a slight crown in the middle of this intersection. If you've got too much speed coming across through here trying to beat a red light, I've watched cars go out of control. We've seen at least one flip. Um, several accidents that almost happened. Officer Foster says more than 50 accidents happen here each year. We'll just let the numbers reflect that if the area is an uptick, we focus our attention to that area, you know, give it a little extra love, so to speak. Foster says the method has helped decrease the number of accidents here at this intersection over time. She says their goal is to make sure drivers see police on patrol and focus their attention back on the road where it belongs. So while these intersections may be unavoidable, using your cell phone when you drive through them is. So putting down your cell phone while you drive is certainly going to make your commute a lot safer for everyone. Live in Roanoke City, I'm Rachel Lucas, WSLS 10. All right, thank you, Rachel. And we'll wrap up our coverage tomorrow in the New River Valley.